Moving on, wardens step in, and the cell leader is taken to the hospital for treatment. The prison warden visits the infirmary wings of the prison, and wonders why he for the reason he chooses to save Chang Ho's side. The cell leader calls him close, and whispers a master plan in the warden's ear that surprised him. As a punishment, all the inmates who were involved in the combat are thrown into isolated detention. Very soon, Chang Ho, Jerry, and his team are let out but not the attacker. Meanwhile, at Guchen University Hospital, Miho injects the dexamethasone, but suddenly the patient starts to experience pain. She is confronted by the doctor and nurses for giving the wrong dose of medication. But clever Miho shows the photo of EMR which clearly shows that, Miho did as asked by the doctor. Clearly, someone appears to be attempting to get her out of the hospital. Is it the director of the hospital, or there is someone else who wants her out? Later at the hospital conference, in front of the entire audience, Miho stands up and claims to have the unpublished papers of late Dr. Seo. Everyone in the hall is shocked to know that, and Mayor Choi's wife couldn't believe her ears. That night, after the shift, Miho informs her father who is worried about her, and also warns her to be careful. And yet she has not found the unpublished paper. She was at a dead end with no leads, so she threw a bait hoping to get someone hooked. While walking to her home, she notices that someone is following her and run away from him through the alleyway, and hides behind the wall. But thankfully before evil happens, she meets with her father. Somehow Mayor Choi happens to know about the paper and calls Miho. And both agree to meet. Back at the hospital infirmary, Chang Ho meets with the cell leader and asks, why he took that shot. To which cell leader answered saying that, he is last hope for him to find his lost daughter, because he is a big mouse and can do anything, thus took a shoot for him. Surprisingly, the inmate who had tried killing Chang Ho hung himself in solitary confinement. The prison warden suspected Chang Ho of killing him because, it is difficult to kill themselves in solitary confinement. The following day, Miho and Mayor Choi meet. Mayor quickly asks if she has the unpublished paper. She tells him that she is trying to find it, and asks his help for that. Mayor Choi doesn't see any obligation to help her. To which she says that, he is the sole reason her husband is behind the bars. Mayor Choi wonders if she still trusts him and also says that, real con artists scam people closest to them first. Miho trusts her husband and insists that Chang Ho is not a big mouse. Furthermore, she informs him about the hospital DNR request policy, and how the hospital is forcing patients' families to sign it, even though the families are paying them. And she strongly believes that hospital DNR requests are related to Professor CO's paper, and urges that there is something linked up with the hospital director. However, Mayor Choi refuses to accept her claim saying he trusts her wife. After the suicidal accident, though Chang Ho did not kill him, however other inmates fear him and start to respect him even more. Increased frame and popularity of Chang Ho pulled Ji Hoon to prison. In their meetings, and asks him to return 100 billion won of Lala capital. However, Chang Ho denies to return and if he does so, then Ji Hoon wouldn't have any purpose to keep him alive in the prison. Listening to Chang Ho, Ji Hoon becomes more suspicious of his identity, and to confirm it, he asks Chang Ho to give him the name of five big clients for whom Big Mouse sold drugs. Before leaving, Ji Hoon gives Chang Ho a weak time to remember the name, and threatens to kill him otherwise. On the way back to the cell, Chang Ho knocks out the guard, grabs the guard's phone, and quickly calls the mayor. He explains how the real Big Mouse turns him into a Big Mouse, and throws him inside the prison. He then seeks help from him in getting the name. After that, Mayor Choi orders his guards to spy on Ji Hoon and inform every move Ji Hoon makes, and also asks to find out if there is any connection between the prosecutor and Ji Hoon. A short time later, the inmates in solitary confinement start to panic, and request guards to help them believing that, Big Mouse is soon going to kill them. As a result, the prison warden directs the guards to shift them to the general ward. Later in the cafeteria, those two inmates as they begin to eat but then collapse. They both foam at the mouth. This assures Chang Ho that the real Big Mouse is nearby and playing the game. When the warden watches the CCTV footage, he finds that both inmates had eaten cyanide. Moving on, Ji Hoon goes to meet an elder along with his assistant. He is asked to wait in the lobby by elder's man informing him that, the elder is busy with someone. Soon they find Ju He there and are astounded to see her there. The elder man also informs Ji Hoon that, the elders refuse to meet him until he returns 100 billion one of his. Nevertheless, Ji Hoon is asked to meet the mayor at the restaurant, 
and support him during the meeting with some influential politicians. Later that evening at the restaurant, all of them talk about the upcoming election, and the chairman of the party wants to continue Mayor Choi as a mayor. But later in the restroom, Ji-hoon seems unhappy with Mayor Choi for advancing in politics without consulting him, and blames Mayor for becoming cocky despite the money and energy he had put on Choi to make him the mayor. In return, Mayor Choi tells him that he now no longer will again give Mayor candidacy, and also from onwards he no longer works for his benefit, and threaten Ji-hoon not to cross the line. After the mayor leaves from there, Ji-hoon plans to destroy Mayor's life as he has something that could be used against him. Miho is returning home after her shift. She senses someone following her. She quickly texts her father and hatches a plan to catch that person. Her father, Soon Tae Soon captures that man and turns out to be a mayor's secretary. She quickly informs Mayor Choi, and he rushes to meet her and tells her that he did it for her safety. He then gives the paper containing the name of the VIP buyer, and asks her to give the paper to Chang Ho. The following day, Miho goes to prison and meets with Chang Ho and gives him the paper containing the name list. Over at Ji Hoon's residency, Ji Hoon reveals that the name list in the dairy was handwritten by himself, and had asked prosecutor to give Mayor Choi. Ji Hoon wants to see how Mayor Choi uses the name list and is confident that, it will come out of Chang Ho's mouth. Well, what a master stroke. Meanwhile, at the prison, inmates talk about the recent incident, and also talk about the rumors that the big mouse is using some strange sorcery, and forcing the inmates to eat the cyanide. Parallelly someone at the prison is organizing the bet. Each bag containing 100 million won is entering the prison. The prison warden is also informed about the bet by one of the guards. All the inmates wonder who will stand by the end of the month and win the prize. Turns out that the whole bet is organized by Jerry. The three VIP captures him and takes him to Chang Ho. Jerry confessed to Chang Ho that, he uses his name and runs the bet. And according to current baits from the inmates, all the inmates believe that Chang Ho will manages to get rid of VIPs. Shortly, Mayor Choi is in the art gallery looking at some paintings when Ji Hoon joins him. He informs the mayor that he is on the way to the prison, and wonders if he likes to join him. Ji Hoon also informs him about ongoing betting at the prison. Mayor Choi is confident enough and says that, if Chang Ho is the real big mouse, he will surely give him the list. But then Ji Hoon reveals that the mayor possessed name list is fake. Mayor is completely in shock and quickly calls the prison warden, however, the prison warden intentionally doesn't pick up the call. Inside the prison, a guard comes to take Chang Ho, and when he steps out, he sees all the inmates in the prison standing by his side, and chanting him as big, big. Chang Ho then heads to meet Ji Hoon with the full support of the inmates. 